How to deactivate messenger account on PC. Hello guys and welcome back to the channel. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can deactivate your messenger account using your laptop or computer through the Facebook settings. So let's get started. First of all, you're going to head over to any of the search engine and open the messenger desktop application and then log into your account. And once you do so, you'll be able to see an interface like this, but obviously you'll be able to see all of your chats. And then you got to click on your profile at the bottom left. And once you do so, you'll be able to see a couple of options. So you're going to scroll down and click on privacy policy. And once you do so, you'll be taken to another interface of Meta Privacy Center. And here you're going to click on manage your accounts. And once you do so, you'll be taken to another interface of manage your accounts. So over here, what you're going to do is simply click on personal details. You'll be able to find it under the account settings option. And here you got to click on account ownership and control, and then you got to click on deactivation or deletion, and then you got to click on deactivate account. So deactivating your account is temporary. Your account and main profile will be deactivated and your name and photos will be removed from most things that you've shared. So simply click on continue and here you got to verify typing in your password. So I'm going to type down my password. And after that, you got to click on continue. And once you do so, you'll be taken to another interface where you got to choose that why you're deactivating your account so i'm going to type in this is temporarily i'll be back and then click on continue and here they're going to say that taking break from facebook and you're going to type down like after how many days your account will automatically be um, you know reactivated so i'm going to click on seven days and click on continue so after that what you're going to do is simply head over and click on deactivate my account so that's it for today's video if you found this guide helpful give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more helpful tutorials i'll see you in the next video